In this video, I have compiled a list of the top 5 best tent heaters in the market that are worth buying. So let's get started. Number 5 If you're loving the simplicity, reliability, and safety of the classic Mr. Heater Buddy but need something with a little more muscle to heat a larger shelter, you're in luck. Mr. Heater also makes the MR. Heater Big Buddy Portable Propane Heater, which is essentially a dual canister version of the classic Buddy that cranks out double the maximum output to a whopping 18,000 BTUs. The higher output of the Big Buddy makes it a favorite of winter hunters, ice fishermen, and winter campers. It's also a common sight in small cabins and is an emergency heater for winter storms, which really speaks volumes to its outright power. The Big Buddy's dual 1 pound canister system is rated to run up to 10.8 hours on its lowest setting, and users regularly report getting around 3.5 hours at the highest setting. There's also a medium setting available for folks who want a better balance of heat v longevity. Either way you're still getting the same great safety features as the original Buddy heater, which makes the Big Buddy our favorite gas-powered option for larger shelters. We certainly wish the Big Buddy lasted a bit longer on higher settings with its added fuel capacity, but give Mr. Heater props for offering an option hose attachment that allows the Big Buddy to run of a full-size 20 pounds propane tank for 40 plus hours of continuous heat. Number 4 The Mr. Heater Little Buddy is the simplest, most compact option from the folks at Mr. Heater and is one of the best-selling tent heaters in North America. The Little Buddy is stripped down to the bare essentials for the most packable design possible, and as a result is the easiest propane heater to use we've seen. There are only two buttons on the Little Buddy, on and off. To start the heater, you simply hold down the big read on button, which doubles as a switch for the internal piezo igniter as well. When you're done using it, just hit the big black off button. Couldn't be simpler. Simplicity aside, this is still a Mr. Heater product, so you'll get top-notch safety features built in as well. Believe it or not there's both a tip over safety and a low oxygen shut-off feature hidden inside the little buddy's compact frame. For thousands of campers, this simplicity and ease of use are exactly what they're looking for in a tent heater, but it can also be viewed as the main shortcoming of the little buddy. For instance, there's no way to adjust the heat output, so you're either getting 3,800 BTUs or no heat at all. There's also no adjustability for the angle of the little buddy, so although it looks like the head can be swiveled or aimed in a particular direction, just know its 45 degree angle is locked in permanently. Of course Mr. Heater chose to keep the little buddy simple on purpose, and everything from its two-button design to its optimized heat output was intentionally engineered to make this the best little tent heater for a small to medium-sized shelter. Anyone looking for a basic yet reliable and safety-rich heater need look no further, especially if they have no intention of using anything other than standard one-pound propane canisters. Number 3 while Honeywell 360 degrees surround heater is not designed for the minimalist camper, tent, dehydrated camping food, and sleeping bags, it is perfect for those who are at least near the plugins of an RV at a campsite. You get two different heat settings, as well as a singular fan option that doesn't push any heat at all but provides air circulation, making it great for warmer weather too. The chassis is designed with an easy carry handle and sturdy base. When it comes to the industry safety standards, Honeywell took it 10 steps further, with overheat protection, an auto off timer option, and tip over protection. This is one of the safest electric heaters out there. And with a 360 degree spin to push out comforting heat, you'll be able to enjoy this heater in a small group as you huddle around the heater. <laughs> Number 2 Searching for the best tent heater for my camp urban, I very nearly opted for the Mr. Heater, but I wanted to try a night without one in the snow to see how it would feel. Turns out, my van is really warm so I decided to save money and find a smaller space heater option. 
I found a Campy Gear Chubby 2-in-1 portable propane heater via Amazon, and knew I'd found the one. The reason I jumped on it? I love the versatility of having another burner to cook on. I love to cook and often will make big breakfasts for my friends before ski days, and while my two burners stove is often enough, sometimes I have a lot of pans on the flame, and I love having this as a backup, and I save a lot of space. This tent heater for camping comes with a convenient carry case, which I hang on my van walls. While small, this heater can provide 9,000 British thermal units of heat. Additionally, I can use butane or propane tanks to fuel it and operate it and cook, heat or cook in heat mode. I've found it perfect for short heating stints but have not used it overnight. Number 1 Apart from an attractive price point and immense power on the Mr. Heater 4K to 9K BTU portable radiant tent heater, you get the safety and security of the dual sensors, if this falls over, or if the oxygen quality in your tent or camper dips below a reasonable level, this will automatically shut down to preserve your safety. Mr. Heater 4K to 9K BTU comes with a hose that attaches to propane tanks, so you can run this all night long in a 225 square foot space with no problem. Bear in mind that when you reach over 7,000 feet above sea level, this is going to shut down pretty easily, the air is thinner, so the oxygen depletion sensor is going to go off more often. But overall, this heater is a fantastic buy that isn't going to burn through your fuel too quickly, all while providing an excellent heat source no matter your needs. A close friend of mine has used this in their camper for years without issue. This space heater also uses propane effectively to minimize costs. Thanks for watching guys, that's all for now I hope you guys liked this video. If this video is helpful to you, please make sure to like comment and subscribe. Hope to see you guys in the next video.